running of the 14th Craven Filter Miracle Mile, Howell Park fans are entertained with a dazzling display by the famous dancing Andalusian stallions from El Caballo Blanco. Tonight, the Andalusians are led by Spanish riding master, Senor Manuel Mendez, riding Bilador, the purebred Bay Andalusian, followed by riders in costume on white Andalusian stallions. The first El Caballo complex was built by Perth businessman Ray Williams at Waraloo in Western Australia. Following its success as a tourist attraction, in 1979, El Caballo Blanco was opened at Catherine Field in the Camden Valley on the outskirts of Sydney. Cravenfield Miracle Mile, introduced to the Australian trotting calendar in 1967, is the biggest sprint event in Australia and the most internationally known race in this part of the world. Although the Inter-Dominion Championship is recognised in Australia and New Zealand as the premier trotting event each year, the Cravenfield Miracle Mile has aroused much more interest overseas, particularly in America. The Cravenfield Miracle Mile has done more to put Australia and New Zealand on the world's trotting scene than any other individual event. The six selected horses and two reserves for the 1980 Cravenfield Miracle Mile have amassed more than two million in prize money and as such is the richest field ever assembled in this part of the world. Ken Booth, Minister for Sport and Recreation, will present the trophies to the connections of the winner of the 1980 Cravenfield Miracle Mile. The presentation will be made at a trackside ceremony immediately after the race. of excitement grips the big crowd as the magic moment nears when the dancing Andalusians will lead the Miracle Mile Pacers onto the track for one of the world's great sporting events. Thank you. 